Well, uh, thank you, uh, Screaming Hearts, uh, for uh, performing on Valley African Sessions. It was a great set. Thank, thank you, you for having us. It was awesome. Uh, first off, can you uh, tell the tell us a little bit how you uh, formed as a group? You want to do that since you're so good at it? As with any good relationship, it started out based on deception and uh, white lies. Uh, Kelsey, <laughs> no. <laughs> Kelsey, um, Kelsey posted something on Facebook, and I came across it, and. Uh, Myself and the other um, mus musicians in the band, minus Kelsey, were playing in a band, The Tangled Web, and I heard Kelsey's EP, and I was like, messaged her, I'm like, yeah, Tangled Web will be your backup band, like, we got everything. And then I went and told the band, I'm like, hey, uh, we're going to play for Kelsey. And they're like, why would you agree to that before talking to us? I was like, just listen to the CD, and then they listened to it, and they were like, oh, yeah, totally, we got to play with her. <laughs> <laughs> I loved it because, like, I was, I really don't enjoy playing bass in, or, like, a traditional rock band, you know, slash metal, I guess you could say, Tangled Web was classified as, so like playing in a pop rock slash indie band is a million times better, in my opinion. Okay, ouch. <laughs> <laughs> what? I no, mean, it, was it was awesome, music, we, and like, we all just... admit now, like, that we found each other, it's all, it's very, like, mutual, yeah. we're all so appreciative that we found each other, because, I mean, same thing with me, I was playing by myself, with my guitar, which, you know, I play guitar, but I'm not very confident with it. And um, it's just, I've always just wanted to sing. I like, I like, you know, dabbling with instruments, but I love just singing. So when they came to me and offered, it's just, it's been awesome, yeah. so. So uh, how do you guys write the material? Is it as a group or are there a couple of principal songwriters? I mean, lately it's been everyone, pretty much. Yeah. I mean, when we first started, they were playing Kelsey Bayette songs. So it was stuff that I had just released an EP um, pretty much two months before they contacted me. So we were playing all the stuff that I had already released by myself. And then throughout the time, it had been, you know, Tanner and Alan kind of writing the music and then I would write the lyrics melody and now Joe is writing songs and so I, I write the lyrics and I write the melody and then they do everything else. Yeah. And uh, who are your influences? Uh, different groups or solo artists? You guys? I'm going to think of something wicked. I've been uh, influenced by Motown recently. Um, R&B, <laughs> I like um, indie music, stuff from the 90s. I've been listening to a lot of Stone Temple Pilots, learning a lot of uh, Robert DeLeo's bass lines. For me, it's a lot of like Janis Joplin and Etta James. In high school, I joined the jazz band and it totally changed my life. So a lot of, you know, Billie Holiday, Etta James, stuff like that. But I've always loved Amy Winehouse, obviously, but Janis Joplin is like my number one. Um, Kurt Cobain, yeah. that was like what like got me into songwriting. And like, I kind of like, like went from like going like, yeah, this simplistic, like, songwriting structure and then developed to like more like post hardcore type stuff and now it's just kind of back to this you know just like simple song structures catchy melodies you know a lot of different stuff yeah. so are you, are you working on any uh, new projects as, as far as recording yeah we're actually planning on releasing a full album in 2018 oh, so cool yeah can you, can you tell me more about that Scraping up the funds right now. Yeah. Yeah, it's yeah. really about money right now, which is sad. But I mean, we we have so how many songs do we have right now that we haven't recorded yet? Like twelve. Yeah. So we wanted to write like twenty songs and then like, you know, basically hand pick like twelve. Yeah. 12 of them, you know. But they've all been like. Yeah. It's right. it's yeah. you know it sounds um, cocky or whatever, but it's like us saying it about the other people that wrote them. You know, with like yeah. Alan and Tanner and Joe. It's. They all have been writing such awesome stuff that we haven't really cut much. So yeah. now we're kind of ready to just go and in think, with it. And I think the album's going to be a lot of, it's, it's going to like be all over the place. Like it's yeah. real dancey. The genres are going to be yeah, totally. It's big rock songs. Huge and like variety. Folky yeah. songs. Like, so it's like, we're really not putting any limits. Like we have like a 50s swing song. Yeah. We like have, just whatever, you know, just, whatever. Somebody brings a song to practice. Yeah. We're not like. A blues song. Yeah. We're like, that sounds yeah. great. We're going to play it. Like, yeah. you know, we don't so judge we, it based on the genre, yeah. so to speak. You know, but. Hmm. Um, so do you have any shows coming up uh, early February? 
March not, we have a lot of yeah, shows. Yeah, not in February. But yeah. March is cool to talk about too. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we, I mean, we kind of... Oh, yeah, it's not gonna... For February, we have a lot of stuff like photo shoots. We have a music video, so we kind of tried to keep it clear. But yeah. March, we have... Uh, March 16th, we have the 13th floor at yeah. Greenfield. With some great bands. We have. We're playing at Hampshire College. Yeah, and then we're doing the Valley Homegrown. All this is oh, on we our have the, the page. Valley, yeah, the Valley Talent Showcase. We were invited to do in March, so or yeah, in March. Yeah, so, I think like the in North fun. in Northampton. I think June second, we're going to be playing at uh, Pearl Street. So that'll be in the club room. It's going to be all locals. It'll be like my yeah. birthday yeah. slash <laughs> celebration. Cool. Yeah, <laughs> so like that's the big one. Yeah. But yeah, that's all on our Facebook page. Well, uh, thank you so much uh, for performing and for the interview. Uh, pleasure to have thank you. Thank you for having thank us. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I know, right?